and welcome to episode number 95 of Creating a Legend. Today we are in the new camp, or the Camp New, and we are playing against Barcelona, rather surprisingly. Second leg of the quarterfinal of the Champions League. Nil-nil was the first leg. Can we pull off the greatest cup shock of all time? You will notice that we are actually now top of the table, which is fantastic. In our last match, we played against Zoya in front of 2,222 people. Bogdan Kovachenko, Washington Ario and Eugene Zitsky scoring the goals to give us the victory. And Olympic D beat Shakhtar. So we were two points behind. We're now one point in the lead with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven league matches to go. Could we somehow manage this? No is the answer. I'll say that now. No. For now though, we don't care about the league. We only care about the Champions League. So the side is Sarniowski is our goalkeeper. Dembele right back, Grebnev left back, Raimundo and Kovachenko and the two central defenders. For Fana from the right hand side, Zitsky from the left, Mikanzi, Tanskyovsky and Starkov in the middle with Rollin as the striker. is not going to be the side because Ekrem is going to start in place of Tanskyovsky. I should have really checked that beforehand, but there we go. I'll repeat my rhetoric from the first game, which was Friday's episode. We have absolutely no no pressure on us whatsoever. We have already massively overachieved. Early free kick, headed away by Raymundo. Played back in. Keen to Pacheco. Ozio shoots over, and already after two minutes, 47 seconds, Barcelona have shown more than they did in the first leg. I must say I'm loving the new camp tonight. It looks wonderful. Lovely little sea of yellow in the corner. Dembele to Ekram. He plays it crossfield to McKenzie. McKenzie turns it inside, but it's cleared away. Keen to Barcelona. They can break. Pacheco. Cantapledia breaking through. Comes into the box. Cross it out. And it's deflected off the post and into the back of the net. Nine minutes gone. Barca have taken the lead. They broke with real pace. Cantapredia got to the byline, pulled it back. Guerrero shot, hit the post and hit Sarniowski and went in. Surprised it hasn't gone down as an own goal. As technically it was, but we we digress. We're celebrating our fantastic league season so far this season. And shot from distance off the bar, cleared away by Dembele. But it was offside from the rebound. We haven't got a foothold in this game, so hopefully we won't get absolutely slaughtered, because that would be a little bit unfair. Guerrero back to the goalkeeper. Sani obviously puts his laces through it, but it gives the ball back to Barcelona. Gilton intercepted. Fafana, now Rollin. But no one up there. Why are you shooting from there, Kevin? Come on. I know we are massive underdogs, but you've got to do better than that. We're going to demand more. 20 minutes gone. Not much happening. Zitsky on the ball. Just tries to find Rodin, but it's intercepts again. Next goal is crucial in this one. As Brandt is on the ball. Cantaplevia. Gilton. Whips in. Header. Goal. 2-0. Faria Cantapledia has probably put Barcelona into the next round. Nothing much to really say about that. But to be honest, he had a free header in the six-yard box. You can't really allow a player of Barcelona calibre a free header in the six-yard box. Free kick. Guerrero to take. Whips in. Headed away. Guerrero again on the ball. Cross it across field. And Sani obviously makes the save. Can we get a foothold back in this tie before half time? We're breaking from the back for Farna now on the ball. He finds Ekrem. Dembele. Our deep line playmaker Ekrem on the ball. And he's already been booked, which is fairly standard. For Farna now on the ball. On the right hand side. But he's tackled and Brandt can break. Pace. We're letting him run. We're letting him run a lot, but a good tackle. But it's gone to Pacheco. And Tarniovsky makes the save. It's been North Barcelona in this first half. And as you would expect, they have really been quite clinical. And that looked like it may have been a penalty, but it's, we're playing on. And Brandt is on the ball. Inside to Guerrero. Shot deflected. And it will be a throw in to Barcelona. One way traffic. And unfortunately, we have wilted a little bit. But as I said before the game, we have already massively overachieved in the Champions League. So we're going to get a massive wedge of money at the end of it. So that's all that really matters. I've gone to my go-to, we're chasing the game, we've lost, so let's just go for it. Formation, we've gone 5-2-3, we've brought on a couple of changes, we've brought on McKaylee and we've brought on Ario for Ekrem and Zitsky, the two guys that have been booked in the first half. And we've gone attacking, so this could be 6 or 7-0 at the end of it, or it could be 
2 0 at the end of it. And now we're gone, and no highlights in the second half so far. We have come into it a little bit more as that Barcelona have a corner, but it's cleared away. Cante Pelivia. He'll get the ball back in. But it's in, McKenzie wins it. Can we break? Ario. Rollin. We need a goal now if, it's, if anything's going to happen. For Fafana. That's woeful. But we win it back. Starkov. And that's poor again. It just hasn't been our night, unfortunately. And when you're playing against Barcelona, you really need it to be your night. Otherwise, you will be beaten. And Keane is in. And Keane makes it 3-0. Devastating attacks from the Barcelona side. Oh, well. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, oh well, when I fully expected it to happen. But we had a chance, they broke, they scored, and we're out of the game. Fine. We're just going to go to counter now because it's game over. But we have a highlight straight away. If this goes in, we go back to attacking and we just throw everything at them until they score the fourth. Grevnev on the ball. Kovachenko. Gives it away to Keane. Ball over the top, but we win it back for Romero Dembele now. Fafana. Try to trick and lose the ball. That's the second really bad bit of form by Hamid Fafana. Brandt crosses it in. Keen 4 0. Two in two minutes. And twice it's been Hamid Fafana has given the ball away, and that is massively costing us. Taylor is going to come on for Fafana, who's had a shocker. Recently given him a new deal as well. I'm going to probably ask for it back <laughs> at the end of this one. You don't want to have a bad game in the new camp against Barcelona but we have and we are picking up a lot of bookings so imagine the first game of next season's Europa League or Champions League depending on what we get into will be a depleted side but head held high we have done fantastically well in the Champions League so far as rolling could be in and piss the bar head held high in the Champions League we've massively overachieved I don't know. <laughs> It seems to be every second word is me saying massively overachieved, and we have, but we are crushing out tonight. A few minutes to go now. Oh, we've, oh, look at our average ratings; they are absolutely horrible, which doesn't happen very often for us. But every now and then in the Champions League, you are going to get destroyed, and that could be Grebnev picking up a late second booking. It is Alexander Grebnev is going to have that early bath. So our Ukrainian left back is going to miss the start of next season's European campaign, no matter where we are. Is there any point? We're going to go to contain and just play out the last ebbing moment of the game as they get a fifth. Skriniar from the corner. I knew we'd lose this one, and drawing the first game nil nil did make me feel slightly more optimistic but we've been outclassed away from home in the Champions League this season we have been royally stuffed more often than not Man City scored four against us Milan scored four against us Barcelona scored five against us ah well let's just get on the plane go home we've got a league game in a couple of days and we are top of the table so a positive there so Thank you very much for watching. I haven't enjoyed this one as much as I enjoyed the last one, but I hope you have enjoyed it more. I've been here for the novice. You've been the audience. We'll talk again very, very soon. Good night.